Hello to all nations, tribes, peoples, and tongues. Welcome to Storytime with Ray, where we read the King James Version of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation to take in the wisdom and understanding from the Word. Thank you for joining, and God bless. Joshua chapter 15. This then was the lot of the tribe of the children of Judah by their families, even to the border of Edom. The wilderness of Zin southward was the uttermost part of the south coast, and their south border was from the shore of the salt sea from the bay that looketh southward, and it went out the south side to Malekreben, and passed along to Zin, and ascended up on the south side unto Kadesh Barnea and passed along Hezron, and went up to Adar, and fetched a compass to, Com to Kartha. From thence it passed toward Asmon, and went out unto the river of Egypt, and the goings out of that coast were at the sea. This shall be your coast. And the east border was the salt sea, even unto the end of Jordan, and their border in the north quarter was from the bay of the sea, at the uttermost part of Jordan. And the border went up to Beth Hagra, and passed along by the north of Beth Araba. And the border went up to the stone of Bohan, the son of Reuben. And the border went up toward Debir, from the valley of Achor. And so northward, looking toward Gilgal, that is before the going up to Adunim, which is on the south side of the river. And the border passed towards the waters of Enshemesh, and the goings out thereof were at Enrogel. And the border went up by the valley of the son of Hinnom, unto the south side of the Jebusite, the same is Jerusalem. And the border went up to the top of the mountain that lieth before the valley of Hinnom westward, which is at the end of the valley of the giants northward. And the border was drawn from the top of the hill unto the fountain of the water of Nethoah, and went out to the cities of Mount Ephron, and the border was drawn to Bala, which is Kiresh Jerem. And the border compassed from Bala westward unto Mount Seir, and passed along unto the side of, of Mount Jerem, which is Chephalo, on the north side, and went down to Beth Shemesh, and passed on to Timnah. And the border went out unto the side of Ekron northward, and the border was drawn to Sikron, and passed along to Mount Bala and went out unto Jabneel, and the goings out of the border were at the sea. And the west border was to the great sea, and the coast thereof. This is the coast of the children of Judah, round about according to their families. And unto Caleb, the son of Jephunneh, he gave a part among the children of Judah, according to the commandment of the Lord, to Joshua, even the city of Arba, the father of Anak, which city is Hebron. And Caleb drove thence the three sons of Anak, Shishai, Ahiman, and Talmai, the children of Anak. And he went up thence to the inhabitants of Deber. And the name of Deber before was Kiriath Sefer. And Caleb said, He that smiteth Kiriath Sefer, and taketh it, to him will I give Asha, my daughter, to wife. And Othniel, the son of Kanaz, the brother of Caleb, took it. And he gave him Asha his daughter to wife. And it came to pass as she came unto him that she moved him to ask of her father a field, and she lighted off of her ass, and Caleb said unto her, What wouldest thou? Who answered, Give me a blessing, for thou hast given me a south land. Give me also springs of water. And he gave her the upper springs and the nether springs. And this is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Judah according to their families. And the uttermost cities of the tribe of the children of Judah, toward the coast of Edom southward, were Kabzeel, and Eder, and Jagur, and Kina, and Dimona, and Adada, and Kadesh, and Hazor, and Ithnan, and Ziph, and Telem, and Bealoth, and Hazor, and Hadata, and Kerioth, and Hezron, which is Hazor, Amam, and Shema, and Modala, and Hazar, Gada and Heshmon and Beth Palet and Hazar Shual and Beersheba and Bizi Lothiah Bala and Zin and Azim and El Eltolad and Chesel and Horma 
and Ziklag, and Mardana, and Sansana, and Lebeo, and Shilim, and Ain, and Ramon. All the cities are twenty and nine with their villages, and in the valley of Eshtael, and Zaria, and Ashna, and Zanoa, and Enganim, Tapua, and Enam, Jarmu, and Adulam, Sukol, and Azekah, and Sharim, and Adithim, and Gedura, and Gedurothim, fourteen cities with their villages, Zenam, and Hadasha, and Migdalad, and Dilim, and Mizpah, and Jokthil, Lashis, Bozkath, and Eglon, and Kabon, and Laman, and Kidlish, and Gedera, and Bethdagon, Nama, Makeda, sixteen cities with their villages, Lebna, and Ether, and Ashan, and Jipta, and Asna, and Nezid, and Kela, and Ashzim, and Marisha, nine cities with their villages, Ekron with her towns and her villages, from Ekron even unto the sea, all that lay near Ashdod with their villages, Ashdod with her towns and her villages, Gaza with her towns and her villages, unto the river of Egypt, and the great sea and the border thereof, and in the mountains of Shemir and Jatir and Sokoth, and Dana and Kiriath Sanath, which is Debir, and Anab and Ashtamoth and Anim, and Goshen and Holon, and Golo, eleven cities with their villages, Arab and Duma and Eshan, and Janum and Beth Tapua and Aphika, and Humta and Kiriath Arba, which is Hebron, and Zior, nine cities with their villages, Maon, Carmel, Ziph, and Judah, Ind, Jezreel, and Jokdim, and Zanoa, Cain, Gabia, and Timnah, ten cities with their villages, Halul, Beth Zor, and Gedor, and Mara, and Beth Anoth, and El Tekon, six cities with their villages, Kiriath Baal, which is Kiriath Jerim, and Rabbah, two cities with their villages. In the wilderness, Beth Araba, Medin, and Sekatha, and Nibshan, and the city of Salt, and Engedi, six cities with their villages. As for the Jebusites, the inhabitants of Jerusalem, the children of Judah could not drive them out. But the Jebusites dwell with the children of Judah at Jerusalem unto this day. Thank you so much for joining and listening to this beautiful chapter. I highly recommend it as a personal read. Please join me on the next chapter as we dive in deeper into the word. If you do love the word as much as I do, express so by liking, sharing the word with your loved ones, and even subscribing. And may the Lord bless you each and every day.